Welcome. Today, we will be looking into how these backline plant meta are so hard to kill. And, I just found a way to do it. But first, shout out to these people. Letting you know that I am doing shout outs to random subscribers. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe for future Axie Infinity content. Plants are well known for their tanky feature. They are not usually that scary since they are usually placed in front. However, as the Axie Infinity progress, a lot of new metas are rising, diversity of skills, cards, and lineups. I have battled 1v1 a lot of time and this is the hardest. These plant backline meta are scattering in the arena, giving players a hard time around the 1600 to 2000 KMMR bracket. Most of the plants come with these cards making them sustainably hard to kill. During a 1 vs 1 battle, they can force you to use your energy, or else they can steal it. Using your energy and cards sometimes may not be of use due to the huge shield output they have on each round. But before we continue, I would just like to let you know that I am only running with 3 axes since I started to play Axie Infinity. I have tried arranging the lineup and the backline reptile still works best for me against all types of lineups. This lineup has its weakness but it has a huge advantage over the other. It all depends on how you use it. Now how do we stop this backline plant? How do we shut down this broken meta? The trick is using these cards. You may have seen a lot of professional Axie PvP players using different types of disable cards. But to remind you that I only run with what I have and fortunately they work. When you are stuck in a 1 vs 1 battle with this type of plant, chances of gaining more than 2 energy is low. However, these plants do not have enough damage to put you out. They will just wait until the Blood Moon Curse is up. On each round, I can only have 2 energy but, since I have a 0 energy cost card, I can activate the Chomp card. The Chomp card is the key to this combo. I can use it as the first attack card in a 3 card combo for the allergic reaction to get through the shield or the last card in a 3 card combo to disable one card of the enemy. Please note that for either of the two cards that I will use, the allergic reaction will apply 130 damage. That being said, the only way to shut down this type of plant is by doing the same combo over and over again. This plant will do nothing but heal its HP and try and steal your energy. Nothing more, nothing less. As to my experience, there is a chance that this type of plant will run out of healing cards and will be in the same bad situation during the Blood Moon Curse. This plant will only rely on its huge shield output and that's where our Chomp card will take advantage. Enjoy the rest of the video. Also, let me know in the comment section if you think this can be a viable strategy in dealing with the plant backline meta. If you find value in this video, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more Axie Infinity content.